Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today's video we're going to be talking about our new warehouse location here. It's going to be one of our new farms. We're building it out right now. Getting everything ready. If you think that's interesting, hit like, subscribe, hit the bell. Go to CryptoLLC.org if you're looking for someone to set up a GPU or ASIC mining farm. Or if you're looking to buy yourself some GPUs. Alright, so let's get started. So here's our new warehouse location here. Got all our fans, got all our racks being set up, power supplies, wires, plugs, cords, USB, all that stuff. Still messy because we're still building it out. And our racks. You see how we have two layers of racks here. So we're going to have a total of 600 amps at this location. We have two intakes. Here's intake number one. We got intake number two. Our racks are located about maybe the distance is maybe like 12 feet. And uh, we're going to have those big fans next to the intake here, blowing onto the racks, onto the, uh, onto the rigs. And then the exhaust is going to be right over there. That's going to be the exhaust. So that's still being built out. Now in terms of our setup, we're still using our same um, design, which is five rigs, a rack. So you're gonna have one, two, three, four, five. See our frames holding all the racks in place so they don't fall over, tip over. And then our setup is gonna be the 13 uh, GPU rig. So we're using the Q270 Pro. See all these Q270 Pros we just got in. Setting these guys up, they're going to be on 13 GPUs, and we're going to be using a 2400 and a 1500 power supplies. Here's a 1500, it's going to run a certain amount of GPUs, and then got the 2400 right here, it's going to run the rest. Both of them are going to be running on the Tekken, so we can turn on and off both power supplies and then cycle it. That way we don't have to actually be here if there's some problem where it has to be uh, physically rebooted. So we don't want to be here for that. We want to make sure that's, uh, that is wireless. So we're setting that up. Um, in terms of ethernet, you see we're running, we're actually gonna have cameras right here. But we're, we're going to run our ethernet by having two 48 port switches. So I have a 48 port switch, maybe somewhere, probably like, uh, probably at the top somewhere, I'm assuming. Haven't thought of that all the way through yet, but most likely up there. And have the ethernet actually run at the top and then come down for each rig. So I have 148 port on the left hand side and then 148 port on the right hand side. So that should feed all of our rigs Ethernet connection. Now that's going to be for most of the rigs. Um, for the rest of the rigs we also have a bunch of B250s still that we use. We're going to use these up until we don't have any more left. So for some of the other rigs we're going to be using our other setup which is a uh, three PSU setup because the B250 runs on three PSUs. You have to run them on se separate lanes or channels. So we're going to be using our 1600 power supplies here uh, to run the B250s. So it's a little bit different setup, but that's going to be later on. But right now we're focusing on booting up our 13 GPU rigs. Um, in terms of uh, give you guys like a little view at the top, give you guys an idea of how high or how tall the ceilings are here. So we're boarding up all our windows, boarding up all the doors. There's only two doors in, deadbolt locks. Uh, the uh, intake and the exhaust is going to be, uh, have really good uh, sheeting, uh, metal, a lot of screws. Um, we're also going to have it bolted to the garage door um, and, and so on and so on and so on. So. It's a very highly secured uh, location here, so we're going to build that out. We're also going to have a bug net, well not a bug net, a, a blue polyester filter on it with a bug net as well. That will protect um, anyone from uh, actually seeing what's inside of it, what's inside of this place. Also have the fans there. There's a lot of security if someone wanted to get in here and he has to go through all of that. Go through the 2x6s, go through the sheeting metal, go through all that stuff to get in here. And then we also have our automatic police dial camera system 
and uh, and all the other stuff so really really secure nothing should get in here so yeah so currently kind of just unpacking everything you see all the stuff here you already saw the power supplies you can take a look at some of our plugs um, from the other side as well our fans uh, these are 22,000 uh, CFM fans that we run so we're running these guys more electronics and power supplies and more wires and PCI Express power USB 3.0 shielded three foot some Molex connectors here and so on now we got other tools here like we got this uh, what's it called a chainsaw not a chainsaw I forget what it's called it's uh, it's like something blade or something like that anyway it's a it's just a uh, <clears throat> a tool I'll show you guys to cut cut through some metal so I forget the name of it anyway I got our table here all our stuff being set up again we're still unpacking a lot of things we still got a lot of things that we need to you know organize put away set everything up you know getting our nuts and bolts and all that stuff our uh, rebar here well not rebar uh, L L uh, bar whatever it's called got those we got our conduit little runners here so we run conduit through these little plastic pipes or plastic holes here so we run three conduits in each one of these so that helps us organize the conduits got a couple of spare thousand uh, thousand watt G plus power supplies you know I got our bench over there um, we got our frame we're working on building out these walls right now so a lot of stuff going on still uh, working on everything getting everything set up so make sure you guys are subscribed make sure you subscribe to the channel you know send send grandma the link so she can subscribe and grandpa so they can subscribe stay updated on the the build out and the farm build out here and uh, I think half of this half of this place should be fully loaded in the next month and then the other half We'll probably get fully loaded the month after that so in about two months this place will be fully loaded really nice uh rolls of videos we can provide from this location because there'll be so many gpus in here and a lot of uh, noise a lot of gpus a lot of cool colors going off those L, uh those led lights from the risers all that stuff so it's really nice um uh, <clears throat> nice uh kind of what it was like a show of lights basically from all the gpus running all right, so make sure you subscribe. Go to CryptoLLC.org if you're looking for someone to set up a GP or ASIC mining farm, such as this one here, being set up for our clients as we speak. So if you're looking for someone to set up something like this, go to CryptoLLC.org. Or if you're looking to buy GPUs, you have your own farm, and you want to buy yourself some 3070s, 3080s, 3090s, 3060s, TIs, whatever it is, um, 1660 uh, cards, all that other stuff. So interested in any of that, go to CryptoLLC.org. Send us an email. Uh, we have also the uh, available products on the Express, uh, Excel spreadsheet so you can go over there and uh, see what we have available right now. Well that's going to be it for this video and until next time, bye.